Hey guys, this is Matt Johnson with whoismatt.com and Canova has sent me a new toy, specifically their smart motion controller for use with time lapses. And this is the bundle B, so it comes with a motor and a lot of other things. Now, I don't even know what all comes in the box. I have not opened it yet. Well, okay, I did open it, I cut it, but I haven't actually like looked inside it yet, so it's gonna be an adventure for both of us. So consider this like Christmas. I've never actually made one of these unboxing videos before, but it should be pretty cool. So let's get to it. So I'm gonna open it up here. Remember, if you ever need anything cut, get a Bear Grylls survival knife, cause that's the best way to cut anything. They're not paying me to say that. Neither is Canova for that matter. But um, okay, so little, I guess, spacer thing. Followed by, we have a geared, let's see, I can get this down there so you can see it. So we got a geared DC motor. So this is gonna be the motor for the time-lapse controller, which is pretty cool. And it's the 264 to one, which is the standard that they send, so it should be pretty good for time-lapses. Sweet, okay, so we got that, cool. Put that to the side. Um, what is this here? Okay, this looks like the crank handle and harness kit, or the uh, belt, the crank handle and belt kit. So that's also gonna be incredibly useful. And I'm not going through this in any particular order here. See, this is where this comes in handy. So I'm gonna pull out our blade here, figure out what this is. It's like Christmas, oh my gosh. How exciting. Now the, now the objective here is to make sure that you do not actually cut the object inside. Otherwise that, that's frowned upon. So um, be careful. Thankfully this is incredibly heavily wrapped, which is good. I don't even know what's gonna be in here. Ah, cables and wires and stuff, sweet. Okay, so this is like uh, stoppers for the time lapse to tell it when to stop. Uh, the camera, sorry, let me hold it down here. Uh, camera adapter, stop, uh, stoppers. Camera wire that'll adapt to my Canon 7D. Great. Um, no, actually that's the camera adapter. I don't know what that other thing is yet. We'll figure it out, it's okay. Um, adjustment for one of the belts, I think. And an extension wire, probably for the camera, I guess. I don't know, your guess is as good as mine. More mounting things, we'll figure that out in a minute. I don't know what that means. Okay, round number two here. Bear Girl survival knife again, always necessary. Uh, cut away from yourself too. Uh, I learned that from my parents after getting yelled at as a child. Sometimes I do still cut toward myself though when I'm feeling rebellious. Um, let's see here. Ah. ah, this must be the belt. Okay, so there's your belt control. I didn't know it was gonna be gray, that's kinda cool. Okay, so. They said they were sending me two different belts of different sizes, so that's one of them. Cool, I thought one looks like it could be the 80. I haven't, I got one for the 80 centimeter slider and for the 150 centimeter slider. Cause I figure I'll use the 150 for time lapses and the 80 for regular shoots. Um, so, cool. This looks like the battery if I was to guess. This is a nice little bag for it though, I like it. It comes with a little carry strap, okay. Yep, battery container. So I'm probably gonna have to buy 800 little AA batteries or something like that. You push in on that, and now I'm pulling up. It's up on this side. May have to pull it out, I don't know. I don't wanna break it. Be gentle, oh, there's a button on the back too. Okay, details. I look like a noob, so that looks like power. Um, and this, okay, that's just a little plug in there. And it takes, one, two, three, four, oh, just six, oh, 12 double A's, okay. Or it looks like, can it take Canon? Like it maybe get an adapter for it, I don't know. Cool, okay, so 12 double A batteries. I'll have to go to the store, put in an order for that. But that's cool, so pretty sweet. I do like, that at least it's double A batteries and not some like proprietary battery, so that's good. And it has a clip too, which is nice, so. If I want to walk around and look pretty trendy with it on my belt, I guess I could do that. Ah, sorry, I'm dropping things here. I wanted to put the battery back into its little case. Okay, so we got that. 
Uh, what's in this little white box here? First of all, make sure it's right side up. Okay, we got more power stuff here. So power cord, wow, with, that is definitely international. Okay, good, with a travel adapter, nice, okay. So that can go into there and actually let me use it in America, where we are. Land of the free, home of the brave, freedom, okay. So power adapter, sweet, also necessary. That's nice that I can plug it in though. So if I have a power source, I don't have to just cart around a battery and hope it's charged. That'll save me some money. So I think this is the actual controller itself. We'll just push that out of the way. Get this guy here. So make sure that's in focus. That's pretty now. Okay, so I, this is the actual, yep, smart pan tilt controller with the setup guide. Who reads instructions these days? Actually, I probably won't use that later, to be honest. Pretty rope, okay, cool. It's a bungee, okay. I do not know what that's gonna be used for yet. And this looks like a speed ramping thing of some sort. I'll figure that out in a second. Okay, so that's there. Um, this side we have another cable that will connect. But let's get both of these out on the side. Oh, see, I'm clumsy, it's okay. Here is the actual controller. It's about the size I thought it would be. It might be a little smaller than I thought it would be actually, which is cool. Actually, let's get this thing out of plastic wrap. It actually feels pretty nice, kind of like a video game controller. They clearly put a little bit of work into that. I like this padding, it's all form-fitted. Um, like you actually can get your hands around it. Like if I was gonna play a game this is literal. Th that that is an Xbox thumbstick right there. I don't care who you are. That is, that is exactly what I like to use. So that's great. Um, connection stuff. It has a tripod screw. That's cool. So this clearly you don't actually have to put batteries into this. It is metal though. That's nice. Plastic on the top, but metal on the sides. So clearly now that none of the buttons are working. But up increase, down decrease, right left. Sweet, so yeah. I'm gonna have to assemble this whole thing and I will make more videos later on showing tutorials on how to use this thing and other cool things once I figure out how to put all this stuff together. I'll probably start by reading that at some point. Um, but yeah, stay tuned and I will have more videos for you guys in the future, cool. Uh, and be sure to check out whoismat.com because that's my website and it's awesome and I'll have the updates there. Cool, talk to you later, bye.